This testing site in Albuquerque has seen long lines all week and people in other parts of our state are seeing pretty long wait times as well. Our state's top doctor says they're looking into whether or not people from other states are coming here to New Mexico to get a COVID-19 test. Day after day, COVID-19 cases continue to go up in Doniana County. And this uptick we're seeing in cases now and at, the, at record levels. Uh, should alarm every New Mexican. According to state data, in the past seven days, Doniana County has seen a 29% increase in new COVID-19 cases. But could part of that be because El Pasoans are driving to Las Cruces for a test? We are hearing increasing reports, including one this morning, that a lot of people from Texas may be referred to uh, Las Cruces to get their testing because it's so hard to get a test in El Paso. El Paso is seeing a significant spike in cases over the last few weeks, going from 5,745 cases last week to 8,385 today. There's an increase in the percentage of tests done in Las Cruces on people who have a home address in Texas. In an email, a spokesperson for the governor's office said the New Mexico Department of Health sets their testing guidelines, but private facilities may create their own rules which can differ from the Department of Health's. We reached out to DOH about El Pasoans and other out-of-state residents coming over to get tests in New Mexico, and they sent us this statement saying the Department of Health provides COVID-19 testing for people with or without symptoms, with testing New Mexico residents being our top priority. While Dr. David Scrace says there's not enough data to support this, it's something they're looking into. So that's something we're, we're gathering more data on to see if there's data that supports that contention or not. We asked the governor's office whether it would consider closing down our state borders because of this reason or because of the other states that are seeing an increase in cases, but they said no, we're a state, not a country. Reporting in Albuquerque, Marissa Armas, KOAT Action 7 News. And Texas is one of the states seeing cases surge right now. It just reported its highest number of coronavirus deaths in a single day, and it is running out of hospital rooms. In Arizona, another hot spot. The state has led the country with the highest average of new cases per 1,000 people. One out of every three people tested there is positive. Right now, transmission rates are skyrocketing along with California and Florida.